Good evening. Two people are dead and two others injured following an avalanche on Ben Nevis. All four people were climbing on Scotland's highest mountain when the avalanche struck. The alarm was raised with the emergency services shortly before noon and mountain rescue, police and ambulance crews have all been involved in the search and rescue. Well, our reporter Claire McNeil is in Fort William for us tonight. Claire, what more can you tell us? Well, I'm at Fort William Police Station where the rescue effort has been coordinated from throughout the day. Now, as you can see, the weather is quite treacherous here at the moment and there's been very high wind speeds from early morning as Storm Gareth began to make its way across Scotland. And as you said, two people sadly died and two were injured when they were climbing in what's called the number five gully of Ben Nevis. Now, there are five gullies in total and a mountaineering website has said that this one is generally avoided as it's very avalanche prone. And yesterday, the Scottish Mountain Rescue Service um, has said that has assessed the potential avalanche risk here as very high. Now, the police have been coordinating the rescue effort alongside volunteers from Loch Haber and Glencoe Mountain Rescue Team. Some people who were in the area uh, at Leisure Pursuits at the time assisted greatly in confirming that four people had in fact been caught by the avalanche. Uh, we involved the Coast Guard helicopter and the Glencoe and the Harbour Mountain Rescue Teams in a rescue effort and sadly it was confirmed that two of the four people had uh, succumbed to their injuries as a result of the avalanche. Uh, two further people um, are being removed from the hill as we speak, one to the Queen Elizabeth Hospital in Glasgow and one uh, to Fort William until they, be, uh, they, they can be medically assessed. Now this is the latest in a number of climbing accidents to occur on Ben Nevis, which is Britain's highest mountain in the last few months. On New Year's Day, a 21-year-old German student from Bristol University died after she fell from a ridge. And in December, a West Yorkshire man, also aged 21, died while climbing in the Tower Gully area. Now we're yet to receive any details about who these four people were or where, or where they were from, but police said they will issue more information when they can. All right, Claire in Fort William, thank you very much.